How you guys doing? So basically, man, 4 p.m. He'd like to tax your establishment room. Okay. What's the reason for? Yeah. Uh, this is our area, you know. We live right up the road. What so, post, though? So first of all, what what family are you guys or gang? Or they said 4 PF. What post will you guys stay at? Postal 504. Oh, okay. So you got... Well, listen. We're neighbors. Why don't we just help each other out? 504 and we are... 664. So you're about... 1, 2, 3, 4 blocks down. And your territory spans out this way? So here's the thing. You guys are the closest business, right? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Do business with the Lucianos. So, so here's the deal. We've already spoken okay. with the Lucianos, and they're on the same page. So all we're gonna do is this. I can offer you, let's say, a care package. I can offer you a care package of supplies, every now and then, with some cash, guns, maybe even cars. But we demand taxation. Mm -hmm. So here's the thing. We're talking, let's say, you know, 15%, very, very small. Of, let's just say, I guess, every week, every week, 15% when you guys start making actual numbers. Mm -hmm. And any problems, you call us. Have a mutual business dealing with 4PF. You think you can do that? Um, I'm not totally sure because I don't make the final calls, but I could relay the message. All right, just making sure that we're on the same page here. All right, so 4PF is going to be back, and, you know, we, we could talk what you guys are going. All right? For sure. What's that going on out here? Yeah. All right. Pleasure doing business. Is it, uh, is it good? Fucking no. Good. We ain't giving them shit. We're gonna oh, fucking we're let them come them back shit. and we're gonna fucking shoot them up. Okay, here's the plan. Who are they? I was telling your friend that uh, we do have extra doors available on the block. If you guys do want to get an apartment around there, it's up to y'all. Apartments are usually going for like 300k, 350 if you put a garage with it. I was thinking, have you seen those houses on the beach? Those uh, beachfront ones? Yeah, those are going for like 800. Yeah, I was thinking to save enough for one of those maybe, but I mean... Could buy one on the block too. You could have like up to three properties too, so take your time. Okay. Okay. I already have most of the block claim too. Pretty big territory. So even if you guys don't get a spot there, that's totally fine. You can get it like get one there later. If you guys end up wanting to reside over there. Start start claiming some new territory, you know? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh shit. Nine eight two nine, right? Yo, okay. yo, yo, brother, my bad. I was a little busy. I, I thought so. Are you able to wash one point three mil? Um, give me one second. Don't hang up. I'll let you know. Okay. Guys, this is Eric Sire. You ain't no Ben. You ain't no Chris. 
We got Jay Shicey yes, to my right, and then to Chris's left, you got uh, Big Al. This yeah, is uh, nice to meet y'all. Eric Sire, a good friend of nice mine, a good friend of you. ours. Yes, sir. Nice to meet y'all. I'm here if you guys need anything, so. Yeah, feel free to get this guy's number, number too, uh, right oh, after. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah let, let, me, me, let me, I'll toss it to you real quick. Yeah, go for it, go for it. I think I gave it to everyone. Yeah, I didn't yeah, get it. Yeah, I got it. Let me see. I'll give you mine, too. Yeah, I'll just, just pop yeah, back I got it. Head. I guess I'm, got some good right, time cool, in here. cool. Yes, sir. <laughs> yep, let's get you some good business, Eric. Get your pocket. Uh, you yeah. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Right, look, come over here, let me hook you up, Eric. Let me cool, yeah, you. yeah. So I got 1.3 mil on me. All right, cool. Give me one sec. So that's going to be uh, 1.1105,000. Yep. 1, yep. I don't know. I'm not good at math. I just know what the calculator says. Exactly. All right. I sent it to you, brother. Double check Perfect. for me, please. I got cool. it. All right, Sounds big dog. Good. Cool. I'm going to go to the hospital. Um, you guys, if you guys need anything, be, uh, let me know. Otherwise, be safe. So I'll probably hit you up if you're running the mess in the Nexus, bro. I might make your life easier. I'll keep you posted. All right. Cool. Sounds good, brother. Heck yeah. All right, man. You guys you, have uh, a good one. I'll see you, you guys. Um, what was your name again, brother? Jay Shiesty. Can it be your faith in... In the wake of the Cabano hit, Icy emerged from prison with a singular determination to amass wealth swiftly. Amidst the ashes of tragedy, he rallied his crew, orchestrating a daring plan to flood the streets with their rudimentary yet potent product, marijuana. With each baggie distributed, he sought not just profit, but power a means to secure alliances and financial backing for the impending storm he foresaw on the horizon. For Icy, this wasn't just about survival, it was about orchestrating his ascent in the impending war where every move had to be strategic, every alliance forged with steel. Oh no, this is fucking white old. Turn. God damn. It's been a long, long time. Uh, where you been, piece of shit? Well, you know, Jimmy. You taught me one thing, and I took it to the goddamn fucking stars. And what's that? Cocaine got crazy for me. And it ran me out of Vice City. Because I, I lost control. Chaos took over. My order wasn't enough. So what, this is your, uh, this is your skeleton crew? What's left over? Let's just say, uh, I've been in the silence adepts for a long, long time. What do you want? I got a gift. Must what have heard it? how disappointed we are in you. Well, it's been years. I haven't got my ears on the street. In a long, long time. Well, you know, we have our fall ways to the ground. I hear what you've been up to. Things, uh... I didn't hear shit. Things got dicey. Up in the other side. But, uh... A war's stirring. And, uh... I believe this gift of mine could uh, at least give us a little uh, eye to eye, ground to ground, ground on what might be coming next in the future. What's that, a woman? No. Bring me a woman. Don't you know I'm married? I do. I don't think he would do that, Jimmy. But this thing Wait, definitely got a woman's you. name, though. <laughs> yeah? Hey, I don't know if my wife would like that. Okay. 
I got a thousand joints for you. A thousand joints. Homegrown. <laughs> All light death. Hey, I don't know if you remember, but uh, word around town is we're the stick kings. What are you guys, the joint kings? Let's just say I can't get a hold of my flagship product right now. So I had to resort to my uh, elementary ways, which seems to be a very, very uh, tasty thing around here. You know what I'm saying? What percent is it? Would you like to try it? You shitting me? I would love to try it. God damn, you gained weight. Nice. That's right, and you grew your hair out. Look like a loser now. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> I know. So we're even. It's called stress. I see the gray hair. God damn. Reminds me of my ball sack. God damn. God damn. Good to see you, pal. It's good to see you, big bro. God damn. Cousin? Good to see you too over there, Mr. Rockford. Bond OG, huh? Piece of shit, where'd you go to, motherfucker? Speak up, Ben. Yeah. Uh, what happened to our rock for deal? I own that shit. Oh. Yeah. Wow, Jimmy. Lots changed. Tell Ben to speak up. Hey, where's Auntie at? My uncle? Oh. We gotta talk about that? She's not here. Yeah? Yeah. What's she been she in a different city? She doing different stuff. <laughs> Typical Auntie. I always yeah. think the grass is greener on the other side. Am I right, Uncle? It wasn't. Hey, I'll tell you what is greener, though, huh? This goddamn Mary Jane. Holy shit. Oh, for shit. sure. This is some good shit. Hey, yo, you, you losers want to try some? Some good shit. Yeah, I think I do, actually. Yeah, let me hey, get yeah. some of that. Hey, yeah. pass it to the immediate family. Everyone, come on down. Hey, you're looking so tense. Oh, Don't worry. <laughs> Friends. Karen, long, long time. It's been too long. Hey, what do y'all think? You. Some good shit? It's some really good shit, bro. Damn good shit. Damn, you're getting pretty you fried, trying? bro. Hey, be careful with yeah, that mic. Good. Mike, be careful. It might be laced. I've been trying to kill that guy for the past fucking three years. Production's not stopping. As we speak right now, there's more rolling and brewing. But we've been taking a lot of heat since we picked up Rockford. A lot of people do not like it for some reason. Why? Because we're actually making money. <laughs> yeah, right. Exactly. What Please you don't said. Fucking make money. Yeah. Exactly. Like right. the other day. Uh, you show me the receipts and I'll believe it. I'll show you receipts. That's a pretty big ass receipt, big dog. Ah, uh, yeah, right. So what's the next move? Where are these joints at? Ben got them. I got some. Oh, yeah, I got the rest of them, yeah. But check this out. We're taking so much heat. If you guys got any guns in the cell, please hit our line. Get the numbers of my guys. It just hits us out of fucking over. Walk out the front door, goddamn. It's just like 200 gun store all over again. I'm going to get me started on 200. You know I'm what saying, that bitch you did? You done did it. You know better than bringing up you that You know what place. she did, bro. Yeah, I know. What she did to us, the family, the benefits. The repairs, I the know. guns, the Say ammo, the word, I'll go down everything, I'll go down pal. Listen. Next thing is I need you to find me someone in the drug network so I could expand. Vice City's fallen. My record label over there went to shit. My cocaine got crazy. Straight from the good old Cuba. Cocaina. <sighs> You like you know I like when you talk like that. God damn cock sucking, god damn face motherfuckers just took my shit. 
Ah, uh, you getting me fired up. Listen. I have no choice but to start growing with weed before I get my hands on everything else. But, meanwhile, if I ask for help, I need guns and I need someone in the network. In return, we'll figure something out. You have my hey, political don't, backing. Don't we always? Don't we always, pal? All right. Well, we gotta dip out, cause I think my weed, my weed growing is getting really fucked right now. Cause like I said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let up another one, bro. We get hit time. everywhere, man. But at the same time, uh, had to visit the old family. This is where it all started. Yeah, uh, we're still here. In case you didn't know. Yeah. Life on the other side is pretty fucked. Hey, by the way, I got a deal for you. Really? Yeah. A deal Something from right Jimmy Jimmy Flynn. Alley. I need a manufacturer. Okay. Something that deals in your same business. God damn. Yeah. I need something a little bit more compact. Hey, Karen. Did you just say you disappointed <laughs> me? I did, I did, I did. What goes around comes around, huh? Ain't that some shit? Jimmy. I think you misunderstand, though, I see, you know? Whatever you need. You need me to make you some shit? Say less. Yeah. I need, uh... I don't need it in joint form. I need it in brick form. Ah, I see. You get the job done? If I get you these guns? I can make something work. Hey. You never disappoint. I'll give you a call. When I hey. get my hands on some. Give me 24 hours. Hey. Get the fuck out of my palace now. We'll be in touch. <laughs> All right. And uh, and don't let yourself be away too long again like this. I know. Don't worry. It won't be years. Heard that before. But I'll come. I'll come to take a book out tomorrow. All hey, right. Make sure you guys <laughs> grab the joints. I'll be in my. Oh yeah. Office. I don't know who wants to take them. Good to see but, you. Uh, Let's put them in the them. Let's put them in the car. I'll grab them. Yeah, I will also grab them. Okay, here, I got the 500. I'll just, uh... Slide it to me. I handed this shitload out, but here's the rest. Uh, uh 817. 8895. Okay, a little bit more if you have more. Thank you, boss, man. No, I just had the Thank 500, you. and then I think just... God damn. The I feel nostalgia I everywhere I am over here. To, uh, Jimmy. Yes, sir. Okay. Alright, Luchanos. We'll see you All later. Right, brother. Until Until next time. Until next time. Until next time. Safe again. travels. Safe travels. Ciao. Yep, till next hey. time. I forgot. Something else is on my mind. Really? Oh, hold on, guys. Hold on. Jimmy has something on his mind. Get back. I don't know, uh... I don't know if you remember, but, uh... We built something. Something special. Really? It's a thing of ours. Yeah. Back home in Italy. Yeah. So, uh... <laughs> whatever that means. Think about it. Have a good one, Cabanos. <laughs> Alright. As he embraces the family he thought he'd lost forever, the weight of his past and the challenges ahead loom like storm clouds on the horizon. The struggle to reclaim his life won't be a stroll in the park, not with the burden of battle-scarred arms and a deluge of goods threatening to drown him. Just when he thinks he's found solid ground, another obstacle emerges from the shadows, ready to pounce. With his brother's tentative aid, a deal struck in the shadows, the question hangs heavy in the air. What will the next move be for the Cabanos?